So I don't really ever talk about this kind of stuff, but this is something I came across myself. I was editing a video and I saw this and I felt like I had to talk about it. I could be completely wrong. That's why I didn't really know if I should talk about this. It could mean something completely different or it could mean what I think it means, which would be weird. So what I'm talking about is I was editing an Infinite Warfare video, which will be out soon by the way. And right at the start of the game, I had a host migration. My first one in Infinite Warfare, it happened. It was whatever, it was whatever, just normal thing, host migration, move on, right? But when I was editing, I was just going frame by frame like I usually do. And when I got to one frame, it was for one frame only. In like the bottom left area, it said cranked. Just cranked, as if we were playing cranked. The box says 959, which isn't what it says in cranked, obviously. But the box is in pretty much the exact same spot as the cranked countdown timer was on Ghost. I'll put a comparison up on the screen of Ghost. And that, it's pretty much, like, it's the same thing as if you were playing cranked. Instead of 959, it would show 30 seconds, then countdown 29, 28, when you were cranked. And it's, like, remade and everything. It's a new looking design, obviously. So this really makes me think that cranked could be coming back in Infinite Warfare. Maybe even in the second beta weekend. Because also today, they just announced Terminal for the beta this weekend. They're gonna have terminal in the beta. Some of you guys might be thinking I'm so stupid right now. It could mean something else that I just don't know about. That's why I never make videos like this. But to me, that made me immediately think cranked from Ghost. Which, by the way, you guys wouldn't have seen this yet, but I'm on Ghost. I want to play some cranked for this video, but I'm looking on my screen right now and it says zero players in the playlist. Some people are probably like, what video game is that? If you guys didn't know, there's a fan favorite Call of Duty called Call of Duty Ghost, which I'm on right now. And in this fan favorite Call of Duty, I'm being sarcastic, uh, was not very liked if you're new to the COD community, but there's a game mode that was called Cranked. And as you can see in the description right there, kills give you extra abilities, two times scoring, and 30 seconds to live. Chain kills to stay alive. So pretty much the main point of that game mode is you have 30 seconds to get a kill, and if you don't get a kill, you spontaneously combust. You'll just die. When Ghost first came out, that was a really cool game mode. Everybody loved it. It was cool. It prevented camping. You had to run around and get kills. I'm pretty sure it was a good way to rank up too. Everybody liked this game mode. Not so much anymore, as you can see, but it is a cool idea for a game mode. It's just the game that the game mode was in was not very liked. But Infinite Warfare could be liked, and it would make sense because it's Infinity Ward. They made this game, obviously. They came up with this game mode. It would kind of make sense for them to bring it back. So even if I'm wrong about this thing I found, there's still a chance this game mode could be coming back. Oh, oh, oh! There's one person in the playlist! <laughs> I'll go play with that guy. I might as well search. <laughs> so this potentially maybe could be a leak for that game mode. That could be like what they use to put on the screen for that game. I have no idea. <laughs> I found the guy. Aw. Feel bad for him. <laughs> a Call of Duty game. like It's like the best selling game I'm pretty sure every year. And there's one other dude in this lobby. <laughs> I would like to 1v1 this guy and cranked, but it won't let us. So I'm just gonna go on private match so you guys can see what I'm talking about with this game mode. Gonna put on my Space Cats camo. Actually, you know what? I'm gonna put Festive on. I'm feeling festive. Oh yeah! I talked about this in a recent video. I'm gonna put Snoop Dogg as my announcer. That's actually something I wish I'd bring back. That's so cool. You just have Snoop Dogg talking to y'all game. Hey, look at this, guys. You can buy weapons for four bucks. Isn't that cool? Two supply drops cost that much. <laughs> like... Oh! I forgot, you could be a spaceman in this game too. The origins of Rufus. <laughs> I remember when they kept coming out with gear in this game, everybody was complaining like, you can't even see it when you're playing the game, it's stupid. Now it's just like a normal thing in Call of Duty. Anyways, I was gonna play Cranked. And for those of you that didn't really keep up with the Ghost DLC, this is Dome from MW3, it's a remake. Just thought I'd mention that. <laughs> I put 17 bots on, that was probably a bad idea. I was going to snipe, but I think I'm gonna use the Ripper. If you guys don't know, this is in Infinite Warfare. <laughs> Snoop. So the crank doesn't start until you get a kill. I killed him, now I'm cranked. As you can see, it's counting down 24, 23. I'm gonna let it run out so you guys can see me explode. But as you can see, it's counting down and whoa. Frick. Oh, I need to get a kill again. No! Dude! No, 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 no! I put way too many bots on, dude. Dude, please let me hide. Don't look at me. Frick! I can't. Come on, dodge and weave, dodge and weave. No, 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 no! Ah, oh, dude, come on! I can't, I actually can't survive. Five. Four. It's about to go. And... Ha! I, I forgot how big of an explosion it is. Yeah, you just explode. So if you don't get a kill within that 30 seconds, you'll just randomly explode. Which, like, it's pretty easy to get a kill within 30 seconds whenever you have a Snoop Dogg cheering you on. But still, it's a cool concept. By the way, if you guys didn't play Ghost and use the Ripper or try it out or whatever, in Ghost, it was probably the best gun. It's a hybrid. So that's an assault rifle, that's SMG. And as an SMG, it absolutely melts people. People die fast in ghosts anyways, but watch. Look, look, see this guy? Oh, never mind. He, he, uh, he cranked. Okay, see this person? 
This is normal health. I know it's private match, but you see how fast he died? This gun was stupid good and was the beginning of pay to win in Call of Duty. So they brought it back because it left such a great taste in everybody's mouth. There's not really any guns in supply drops in Black Ops 3 that are any better than base weapons. But if there was, Call of Duty would be random luck slash pay to win. Because you can buy supply drops, but you're not guaranteed to get the weapon. In this game, at least you can straight up buy the weapon. Oh, and this? That's a UAV. Kind of. It's a SATCOM. That's one reason people hated this game. It would, like, hardly work, I guess. It would always be destroyed. And then, the kill feed's in the top right, which is just, like, useless and stupid. And this game's kind of ugly, especially the base maps. There's a few that are massive. That's one of the reasons why this game mode didn't work super well in this game. Because if you're playing this game on a map- Actually, I'm gonna end it and go on that map. Um, this map's pretty massive. This map's huge. This map's really big. This map's alright. It reminds me of- What's it called? Throwdown on Infinite Warfare. Not even the way it's laid out, just the style of it. And, um, this map's decently big. Decently big. This map's- oh my- it's this is the map I'm gonna play. It's stupidly big. See that castle there? Oh, what'd I do? See that castle there? That's just a small part of the map. There's a village, another village, a village- Actually, I don't- I'm just rambling. There's- it's just big. So that's why this game mode didn't really work in Ghost. Like I said, listen for Snoop Dogg. Cranked. <laughs> Look at the size of this map! You can go in that- well, parts of the castle. I didn't know you liked to get cranked. Okay, Snoop. I have 17 recruit bots, and it's slow pace. Like- <laughs> So there's like a little village down here, then there's like a broken village over there, and then way over there there's like a main village, and then there's a castle! What a stupid map! All these signs and stuff around the map, the theme of the map is like a tourist destination. That's because there's a point in Call of Duty whenever they try and make sense of map themes. Now they'll put us on a picnic table with cheeseburgers and say whatever. It is what it is. They wouldn't put a medieval castle in a Call of Duty without saying like it's a tourist attraction. They try and make sense of it. So this is pretty much the whole map. I'm treating this as if none of you have played COD Ghost before, I'm sure a lot of you have. But to the people that are new, this is pretty much what's going on. Or maybe some of you guys forgot. Ha! Huh. I didn't know you like to get cranked. You know I like to get cranked, Snoop Dogg. Yeah. I'm pretty sure I missed him by about a foot. Slash and burn confirmed. At least it's boots on the ground. One of my concerns is that eventually Infinite Warfare will feel like ghosts, but with thrusters, which I don't think is a good thing. So hopefully it doesn't turn out feeling like that. Right now I have a lot of fun playing Infinite Warfare. The thing is, if there's like one map that was this massive, it'd be like, ah, eh, okay. But there's like four or five maps like this in this game. Maybe that's why all the maps seem so small on in Infinite Warfare, trying to compensate for how big they were on this game. <laughs> Like, this map would still feel massive if you had an exosuit. And when they give us thrusters, they make them super small! I know I'm super off topic from the main point. That cranked might be an infinite warfare. I just didn't want to make a whole video talking about that one thing. Figured I'd hop on ghosts and show you guys. Whoa! Did a little twirl! Yeah, you cranked up now. Ah! I guess we'll end it on that note. <laughs> Way to wreck the joint, homies. Way to wreck the joint, homies. That, that's still okay. So sorry if I'm just completely wrong about that glitch that happened. So I guess that's the end of this Call of Duty Ghost video. Bye.